Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Um, I just want to say a big, big, big thank you to all my subscribers. I've hit 1,000 subscribers, um, which is uh, a great achievement. I really appreciate everybody that has been watching, subscribing, leaving your comments. You're really, really greatly appreciated and just continue to support. If it's the first time you're joining this channel, my name is Clay. And before you do anything else, just click, click the subscribe button down below. Yeah, that red button. Yeah, that red one, man. Yeah. All right. Thank you for that. Yeah, man. So today's episode is sponsored by no other than Sparkles Auto. Um, Sparkles Auto is located at 7 Acosta Drive in Ocho Rios. And if you don't know Sparkles Auto, been supporting the car scene for a very long time and he's a sponsor for this vlog. Um, if you're looking for any accessories, parts, used parts, new parts, link up Sparkles, man. You don't know. If you don't have it, you'll definitely find it for you. So, yo, people, link him up. It's on Google, it's on Instagram. I'll put the Instagram link just on the screen and you can check out Sparkles Auto and show some support for that, you see me? Today's episode is gonna be a nice little vibe. I will be featuring a very interesting car. Um, a car that I believe is the top customized car locally now in Jamaica. You don't know I always talk about the Jamaican rice scene and how persons would, you know, put their vibe, their own energy, their own style and creativity to a car that you just see regular on the day driving around so yo we're gonna link up with the jeep now nah, i gotta tell you too much right now we just all get into the whole vibe you see me so let's get into it Alright guys, so I'm here with the man Austin. I just, I just seen a few clips I showed earlier. Austin is the driver of you know the bad pro box. So yo, we're gonna make him tell about it still. Know? So yo Austin, yo, respecting MG, what are going? Yeah man, me there, I'm gonna go on easy. Yeah? So yo, just tell the viewers them officially what your name and the vehicle you drive. Well my name is Austin, you see me? Yeah, otherwise name Grung Boss, you know, only for people call me so because I name my care. Well actually me I drive a 2015 Pro Box. You see me? Only for people say you're on a pro box or something else, but we don't know. We don't know what to say. You see me? We just uh, have to make them talk with them and talk and thing, you know? But uh, we just have to work with it. So, mm -hmm. Austin, um, a pro box. I don't know most people know pro box in Jamaica. They evolve over the years yeah. um, in different shape and style. But was a pro box something that you wanted to buy or, or, or you know? Well, so well. A different story. Well, a different story differently, you know? Mother, mother forced me another one. I'm not going to go and tell her, like, you see me? The market's me really that pretty different, you see me? But you to why that go on in a damn time, they shall see how markets and police and Ray and T. Left that alone. <laughs> why you not buy a vehicle where, you know? You can jump in and go to work and rest. I say, alright then. Pro box. Then they did, I'm say, alright then, we get the pro box and thing. I'm say, alright, you know, I want to drive this. Put it in a taxi, I'm saying, so we won't put it in a taxi. And then I mash it up. You see me? Cut long story short, I'm just take it and say, alright then. I'm going to custom it up and deal with it officially and thing and thing and thing. And see there? You see me? I talk, I turn right now. You see and, me? And guys, you know, Austin is located in 
Spanish town as well. They don't know Spain man them and the pro box them on the ground. Um, we're gonna make Aston show we some of the things that he did to this car. Um, we're gonna walk around the car, make sure we're gonna go on feet, and then you can understand what he did to this car to make it look how it look right now. You see me? Yeah, so yo, Aston, where you want to start? I right. start with the headlight. Them. We'll start with the headlight. Them. Big up that part. The headlight, you know? So the headlight was it an idea that you had for yourself, or it was something well, that you kind of that well, kind of uses imagination? Well, in a sense, yeah, yeah, it's me something I have, but I go link him and say you never touch a pro box it, so he might go go in it and yeah. go in it and him do a good job. You know, go in the car and I tell him he always want to demonize still. Yeah, yeah. You see me, and he say yeah, what me go give demonize. And give a halo out on the front tight and give some strips in it and things. You see me? And him do it and him come through and him deal with it good. You see me? Get the ground image inside that too. Seen. Yeah, that, are, that is another thing. People love that one there. You see me? Right, right, so, right. I just basically that. So, I mean, this this front lip that you have on the car, it's not something that came on it for sure. No. You know, was it something that was purchased, already made, or you have somebody who built it from scratch? Somebody who built it from scratch, you know? So you tell us a little bit about that now. Alright then, I stay so boom and there and him tell him, he's a man like this, I'm going in the night time, I'm going to really go sleep at the same time, because he's a car man, so I'm searching it. You see me, I'm there and neck and I see it and I say, yo, I link my bridge in and make him try to sort out that one thing, you know. Link him and he say, yo, the project here got, you know. You see me, and he stay so boom and deal with it, and when he deal with it, it come out and come out good. You see me, shame and big up yourself on that one, yeah. So yes, most persons would want to know, you know, the person, you name send him Shemar, but yeah. where him located and stuff? Well, him located in a Spanish town, De La Vega City, whole heap of people afraid of De La Vega. De La is a cold place, you see me? See, yeah, and, and cool Shemar is with it. Yeah, spirit care, yeah, I'm doing everything to care, you name it. See, you see me? Alright, we are going around to the side now, the wheels them. Them wheels are... Uh, Get the car a nice vibe still. Um, tell us a bit about the specs on these wheels. Well, basically, I wear some 17s. Um, 205. 4017 series, you see me? Um, the offset, I think about zero offset. See. And, yeah, and the suspension, what suspension are you running? Well, the suspension, no matter what it's still in a, a stock, you know, but we work on the shocks and we work on, we pinch a piece of a spring. Also, see. you see me, I will do the same thing for the back, work on the shocks because you do have times when the shocks jump out and all of them things. So the back of this now, we can't jump out and I'm actually double up the back part. You get the message, so no way going there, it's still firm, see you. So, you get the if, you, if you don't mind, Aston, mm -hmm. if you want to give the viewers a kind of an understanding as to how you're able to firm the back of the car, so when we go in at it, don't, it don't basically right, go down. Well, we basically do work on the shocks and we double up the box spring. Okay. You get the message, so we double up the box spring, we double it up with a Honda spring. Seen. You get what I say? And then, yeah, man, it's firm, firm, firm. Now I move from So, when you put weight tonight, it don't really shift? It no shift. And hold that right though. It, it right perfect. Perfect. Tell you, it's right perfect. And only, only for man, I say, yo, oh, we can't drive some man. I say, yo, I don't know. You get what I say? And the front, the process in terms of the shocks working on, mm -hmm. is it that you cut the shock shaft and retread it? Yeah, man, I retread it. You see All me? Right. So I cut that and retread it. Big up Chris. Chris did that one from Della, so you see me? Alright. Yeah, and the side skirt. I realized that the side skirt fit neatly. Was this built for the car or it was bought well, to fit? Well, it built for the car. See? Get to me as a big of Shemar from Della or so Panda one day. Basically, the, the car work on a Della. Everything where you see on the car at Della. See? Get to me as a big of Shemar for that one day too. And the reason why the grung in at that one is because we a man like this. I don't want to say. You get to me as a Virgin, he come to me and other man on Instagram. He say, Yo, them want it to buy and them like it. I'm sorry, right, then X amount. Boom. Sell it. You get to me as a so. The umbro will build them as an empire to make them for me. You get to me as a so. You just carve out the ground in it and you come with a little flame behind it. See you, man. See me people, them love it in the street. You See. get to me as a. And the box curtain as well. It's a nice little fit. Um, based on what you said, it would mean that Shamara built this as well. Yeah, man. I didn't see him. Yeah, man. Nice and neat. And the box of people. I don't know if you want the body kit and stuff for the pro box. And you know the town area. Or if you want to travel to town, see them here. You don't know Shemar. Adela, you can deal with it. See them here. So, yo, we are going to look bit at the interior yeah, and man. tell us what go on for the interior of the car. So, I mean, the seat covers. Yeah. 
Oh, tell us a bit about what you are going for this evening. Well, as I'm saying, I'm a man who really sleep at night. I'm there online and you see it. I get to me and say, and say you know, say this is that good. And red are my favorite color still. So, they never have red. The closest thing was burgundy. And I said, alright, I'm going to run with the burgundy. See. Still, so boom, I run with the burgundy. And it, and it worked out well. Anything else in the interior that you would like to show the viewers well, that's interesting? Well, the curtain. Curtain, I one of them. Whole heap of people love the curtain. See. You get to me and say, whole heap of people love the curtain. Them say, no one foxy and them thing that them see it. You, know? you get to me and say, high end vehicle. Oh, me get it in a pro box. See, see, but see. I just work and once you have a love fit, you have to find ways and means to make it work. You get to me and say. So, Shamar, um, what, what, what next for this car? I see you do have quite a few things. I'm sure you're not finished with it as yet. What else are you looking to do to this car? Well, <laughs> I believe them who watch and sit up all day, you see me? Yeah, man. Just right. look out for you. As I'm saying, just follow me up on Instagram and know, say, alright then. I have say boss there, and anything you might do, you might throw it right, I suppose, more than anyway. See. And guys, I'm going to put your Instagram name on the screen as well, so I'll put that up there. Um, In terms of in the streets, like, you know, when, when you're driving and, and in your whole neighborhood, your, your people in the boat, Spanish town area and everywhere, what the reaction I get from people? Oh, God, man. I love you, care. Everybody from young to old love it. You get to me and say, My mother not really fussy. I want me and my mother say, Yo, she love it. You must know, say, Yo, I know nothing normal. You see me? People in the street like the big being double man, them, them, man, them. You know, no. it's like they want to come out of them care and take my you know? <laughs> You're the man! See, and see. I mean, I really have a problem with that still. So if they want to tweet, they can talk see, to me. See, you get to see, me and say, that's crazy. But otherwise, I'm going to put in a whole heap of love in this. You see me? A whole heap of money it take. You see, just to customize a vehicle for a whole heap take money and it take time. See. You see me? And you have to have somebody good where you can do your work and know, say, all right, then. They're going to do it and put in the best. You see um, me? What would you say is your most favorite customization on the car? All right. You see the front eye car. Just the front eye car. As I'm going to say, from the light to the bumper to the lip. I just love the whole front. Nice, no nice, word. nice. So, Austin, may I ask you a very unusual question, probably? Yeah. Um, since you have the car and since you do the customization, what would you say is your most proudest moment since you do the customization? All right, my most proudest moment. Mm. I have a whole heap, you know. God knows me, I have a whole heap, you know. You see me? Because when we're in the streets, as I said before, all heap of people love the car. So, it's like everywhere we go. Me have good moments, good time. Our fans, them trust me, they love it here. You see me? So, when we say moments, me have to have about every day. See. You see me? So, and I, and I, and I just one day thing, we can't say, right, boom, no, every day. And, and a lot of persons watching, the viewers are watching, and persons who probably never thought they could do this much to a pro box, and, and probably even other cars that they might have, they might have an idea for it that they want to go forward. What advice do you have for? persons out there would like to customize a car what would you say to them well what my really that says still is a good thing but it takes money you see me and it takes somebody real who love car who can sit down and say all right then you know say this is that look good and that now gonna look good yeah you take that person and you have to have a person behind you who willing to make it work willing to make it happen because me never think me that do a pro boxer so. you get to me and say me now go in the car and tell a lie but as i say more while my woman they be beside me i'm a different line still so you see me, it costs more leave at time but I just love when I have to care, you see me see. and then I pull through and I do it and people have to say yo I have this thing in Jamaica you get to me and say, I work with it you see me, so yeah I eat that see. you get to me and say and yo, anybody you'd like to big up no we can't afford the big up uh, first and foremost, I have to big up Father God you get to me and say and then I have to big up Chris from Della Shemar from Della so them man they make it thing possible you see me, big up Sugans that is a must Big up man like Draws, you get them I say? Yeah man, Andre Clooney, Sugar Hands Boss. You see me big up the rest of street family them out there. You see me and I do it and I support me same way. You get them I say? Big up street extreme. You get them I say? Clear, big up your damn self same way. You see me? Yeah, and the whole over there we just a full joy ourselves and make it thing happen. You get them I say? So yeah, all of the team them out there where I support me and I go on with the thing them for most period of time big up on yourself you get to me i say i grown boss so i'm out yo people you see what i go on you know you don't know the man asking with the bad pro box same way i will have vibes so yo 
I hope you enjoy it so far. Yo, we are going to hit the street you now. I'll show you some moving shots, some rolling shots to the car. I'll show you it look when you step on the gravel. You see me? So, check out this. Alright guys, yo, we're coming to the end of another close. We want to say big respect to the man Grung Boss, Austin. Yo, respecting Austin. Big up to Andre, leader of Sugar's Nation. You don't know the Sugar family out there. Yo, Andre, close up the vlogs for me now. Uh, big up the whole Third Royal Society vlogs. Sugar's Nation family, big up on yourself. Do subscribe, leave a comment below, and click the like button. Yeah. Oh Jesus, stop <laughs> ramping. <laughs> Tell me no man. Oh Jesus, stop ramping. You don't know. People, you don't know enough. Mad vibes. Until next time, see you again. Zin out.